Hello, this is El Mu'taz Ibrahim from Rice Company, the agency of Spectro Scientific in Saudi Arabia. In this video, we will have a look at the reference database. So, I am here at the uh, main database. To go to reference database, I have to go to this sub menu, then click RefDB. From here, I have the ability to go to any reference oil and check it, see its parameter and have a look uh, on it. Now, um, let us uh, select any um, oil, for example, Chevron, uh, cylinder, uh, B1, so 680. Now, now I selected this port, port 1, 680, and under this port, there are two created uh, uh, sample ID. Uh, if I wanted to add more sample ID, I have to click like this and add reference I reference sample. Sorry, reference sample, not sample ID. So I have to right click, then add reference sample. When I do that, this uh, window will open, then click OK. Now I opened a new reference sample. Now we can have a look at this reference sample. I will see here that the parameter, a lot of parameter mentioned here. For example, the elements inside this uh, oil, silver, sodium, uh, titanium, zinc, and so on. Also, the reference for IR oxidation, IR nitration, IR viscosity at 40 degree here is the viscosity at 40 degree and here is the viscosity at 37 degree and the viscosity index now this is very important point i want to talk about it in details as long as the viscosity index is mentioned here in the reference sample so this means that i can measure the viscosity at 100 degree of course, it will not be real measurement, but it will be a calculated measurement. Why I can do that? Because the uh, in the reference, in the uh, uh, mini VISC instrument, which connected to this software, this instrument measure viscosity at 40 degree only. But it can take the viscosity index from here and make calculation, then calculate the viscosity at 100 degree. So, unless the viscosity index is mentioned in the reference sample i will not expect to uh, get the measurement of one uh, of viscosity at 100 degree also there are a lot of parameter here here for example a refractive index it is mentioned here here is the water factor here is the substance id substance id is not mentioned here so i have to put it anyway in some oil, I will find the substance ID written, but in other uh, reference uh, oil, I, I want to be like, for example, like this. So to find that, I have to go to the manual of uh, uh, mini lab, this manual, mini lab user, and I will find this table. In this table, uh, uh, I find it in page 269. From this table, I can look for any oil then get the substance id and from here i return back to here and write it for example if it was three five uh, three or five for example shows so i can write it here okay now let us go to another sample, go uh, to another uh, reference, uh, reference oil. For example, let us go to mobile and DTE, then light, then I can create a new add reference sample. Okay, this one. If I look for this sample, here also the viscosity index is mentioned 
and 100 degrees so I expect it to find this uh, I expect it to uh, to be able to measure the viscosity at 100 degree because the viscosity index is already mentioned here uh, what about the subsign? This subsign G is already here, so it is, will not be a problem. I have to write it by myself, 3, 6, 5, and then I, I can work properly. Let us go to another uh, oil, for example this. I will select an oil arbitrary randomly to see, for example, this. Mm, let us choose this. Okay. For this oil, there is also the viscosity index is mentioned here. Okay, that's good. But the service ID, it is not mentioned. So I have to go and define it. Okay, let us go to another oil. Let us see this. And this. Mm -hmm. Here. Here, for this oil, there is no um, there is no viscosity index so i will not be able to measure the viscosity at 100 degree for this uh, uh, reference oil uh, here is the um, sub size d is mentioned here so uh, also it is mentioned here so no problem for uh, the other measurement but i will not be able to measure the uh, viscosity at 100 degree why because it is not mentioned here but if i can by any way or by any mean get the viscosity index from any data sheet or from the internet i can write it here at that time i can measure the viscosity at 100 degree so um, i hope this information is um, uh, valuable for you and please be sure to check the reference oil and set the needed parameter. Uh,